lot of Robert Mondavi, Opus One, See Me. Richard Sand spent decades building Constellation brands into a powerhouse. Along the way, he became an artist. What I did was I took a log of Coca-Bola. Before he joined the family wine business, Sands took a fancy to woodworking and, and never let food. it go. This Coca-Bola is very heavy, so. When did you make this? Mm, probably now, 10 years ago, maybe. Sands may be chairman of the board by day, but he's a woodworker at heart. He partners with renowned sculptor Wendell Castle to it's produce custom-made furniture. And so the chair you can see is very sculptural. And has and a wood mill in Ontario County. I wanted to build furniture. Uh, and for some reason I thought that I could. Sand's latest grand venture is told in this documentary from Constellation Brands. Sands commissioned local artist Len Urso to create a sculpture of iconic winemaker Robert Mondavi. Len comes in and does a presentation and actually presents the model, which is right over there. He said, this is what I think. It's going to be larger than life, as Robert Mondavi was. It's going to be seven feet tall. And um, what do you think? He said, wow. Sand's support of local artists is legendary. I do feel happy when I walk into this building. Constellation headquarters in Victor isn't and just so a workplace. This is where I decided they had to go. It's a show place. Here you'll find pieces by Henry Avignon, Martine Lepore, Michael Taylor, Paul Knobloch, and Albert Paley. It makes me feel very, very good um, to see people have the opportunity to pursue that which really fulfills them. This strikes me as such a fun way it to is. live. It is. It is. And it's called Dreaming Tree. Sands may be known as a winemaker. This is zebra wood. But he's also a woodworker and a major patron of the arts.